Hi Starship fans, welcome back to another exciting episode of the SpaceX updates. In the latest news, Elon Musk himself has revealed that the next Starship could take flight in just six to eight weeks. With the team at SpaceX working tirelessly to repair and rebuild the launch pad, we witnessed the testing of Starship S-25 today. The anticipation is high as we await the upcoming static fire test, possibly happening as early as tomorrow. To ensure the safety of the testing procedures, the authorities closed Highway 4 leading to the Starship launch site at 12.10 p.m. As predicted, today's test involved a cryogenic load test leading up to the engine chill process. However, during the test, we observed a depressed vent from the vehicle signaling the end of today's test. Engine prime test did not happen. As a result, there is a possibility of a road closure scheduled for tomorrow from 12 p.m. until midnight at 12 a.m. Should an engine firing test occur, an overpressure notice will be issued to the local residents tonight. Let us keep our hopes high for a successful outcome. Before the start of today's testing, we had the privilege of receiving stunning visuals from the launch site, courtesy of Paul from Ocean Camera Space Corp. Take a closer look at the recently installed two deluge tanks, their sheer size dwarfs the previously installed ones. It's evident that SpaceX's Starship deluge system is nothing short of impressive. Just look at the size of that pipe. However, there is still a considerable amount of work remaining. The installation of the steel plates, mentioned by Elon, is yet to be completed. Additionally, Booster 9 will undergo rigorous testing on the OLM, and most importantly, the orbital launch mount needs to be fully prepared to accommodate any booster placed atop it. I must admit, I have a small doubt about whether the entire launch complex will be ready in just four weeks from now. Nonetheless, I never underestimate SpaceX's ability to accomplish incredible feats in record time. That concludes our update for today's video. As always, we appreciate your continued support and thank you for watching. Until the next video, goodbye for now.